It's been a busy few weeks for Rudy Giuliani. Aside from the New York Post Hunter Biden saga, Donald Trump's personal lawyer was egged by protesters in the city where he was once mayor at what was supposed to be a demonstration in support of the president, and caught with his hand in his pants in Borat too. Now he's been deployed as one of the faces of Trump's legal challenge to the election results, tweeting on Wednesday, en route to Philadelphia with legal team. The New York Times reported on Wednesday that Jared Kushner, with the election results beginning to tilt Joe Biden's way, was on the hunt for what he described as a James Baker-like figure to lead Trump's legal disputes. Not sure if this is what he had in mind sad face, many registered answers to the question. Even Fox News, which aired the sideshow for a bit, cut away from Giuliani's speech to project that Biden would win Michigan. Giuliani has been joined on his Philadelphia mission by the likes of Harlan Hill, who announced early on Thursday that he's going to war. Hill, who calls himself a Trump campaign advisor, is probably best known for getting banned from Fox News. Back in the city where he was once called America's mayor, Giuliani gets booed at New York Yankees games. In his current role, at least, he appears to have found where he belongs, waving his hands around, with even the old standbys looking away. More great stories from Vanity Fair, the apolitical celebrity, and obituary, how Meghan Markle wound up with Princess Diana's favorite watch, Jennifer Farber, Fotis Doulos, and the true scope of a suburban tragedy, what does justice look like in the Nexium saga? Madonna, Claudia Schiffer, and more, as only Helmut Newton could capture them. Ghislaine Maxwell's unsealed Epstein deposition sheds light on her mystery. Nine power looks inspired by Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez. From the archive, Trail of Guilt, not a subscriber. Join Vanity Fair to receive full access to VF.com and the complete online archive now.